Let's understand the difference between glycemic index and glycemic load. Glycemic index or GI refers to how fast a carbohydrate containing food spikes your blood glucose. For example, white rice has a high GI, so it causes a quick spike. Lentils have a low GI, giving a steadier and slower spike. But here's the catch. GI doesn't tell you about how much glucose you're actually getting. That's where glycemic load or GL comes in, which takes into account GI and the portion size. So glycemic load tells you the glucose impact of consuming a certain portion of food. Watermelon has a high GI of 70, but one bowl of watermelon barely has any carbohydrates since it's largely water. So its GL is low. On the other hand, sweet potato has a medium GI of 50, but its GL can be quite high if you consume a big amount of it. To understand the glucose impact of foods, it is important to look at both their GI as well as GL because how much you eat matters just as much as what you're eating.